hello everybody good to see um everybody here let's quickly have a look see at the participants use here we got a uh, one bad cat anita knapp artist known to see sir ben king of bruno mars cass wiggs shunge charles paul uh darth raven david hughes debbie fode desi daru electric warrior eric b grace haddockman Aflu Motorsport, Heriberto, Hero21, Iranian Pride, Kelly Lolly, Lass Alberg, hope I pronounced that correctly, uh, Liz Graham, Malta, Martha, Mary, Milan, Mistress, Robert Chinnery, Shaka Cat, Shelton Todd, Sonic Stefan, um, Stain to Finn, Sassy Scambator, uh, Tommy, Tommy Landry, I think that's everybody. Hopefully, in, yeah, you can hear me. Oh, thanks for the uh, super chat there. No, okay, very good, very good. Where was I? Where was I? Yes, so I was saying uh, hello to everybody. Um, hello, Dennis. Hello, European man, Mary. Anybody I missed? If I've missed you out, apologies, sir. Uh, but welcome everybody welcome let's get straight on into it and uh and check out the old voicemails just uh scrolling through hello jamie okay so we've got missed call missed call missed call new voicemail oh yes uh in case any of you missed it i did do a little uh collaboration i posted it in the community tab and whatnot so um yeah, yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, I was playing the part of an old woman who didn't know where she was. A grandma. Anyway, here's our first voicemail. It's 34 seconds. $499 for Amazon gift card ordered from your Amazon account. We have put it on hold as your account seems to be compromised to talk to our representative to verify or cancel the charge. Money refund, please press 1 or call us back on this number. 1216. Five three nine. Right, let's dial it. Hello, Shantnu is it? Shantnu Kumar. Apologies if I've messed up your name there, but welcome. Hope you're doing all right. Yeah, I think it's network on this one. We'll we'll give it another try. If it just goes bloop. Yeah, it just goes blub. So, I don't think we're getting far on that one. Let's search for the next voicemail. Hello, Slaughter. Good to see you here. Got a missed call. New voicemail. 19 seconds. Here we go. One of MacBook Pro worth 1,409. MacBook Pro worth 1,400. Bloody hell. Hello, Hinsdale. Hello, Liz Graham. $9. In order to cancel this purchase, press 1 or press 2 for confirm this order. Would anybody press 2? Right, so what was it? Let me just double check. MacBook Pro, wasn't one. it? Of MacBook Pro worth 1490 Yeah, MacBook Pro. Let's dial it up. Let's try it again. I don't know if it's my VoIP or what. Maybe my VoIP. You know, because text now is a little bit tasty sometimes, isn't it? Try the next voicemail. It's 10 seconds long. 10 seconds long. 10 seconds of nothingness. That's bloody good, isn't it? Okay, let's move on to the next one. Hello, Jason B. Got missed call, missed call, missed call, missed call, missed call. Missed call, missed call. New voicemail. Here we go. This one is uh, 45 seconds on a tingtail. Or For your computer technical support recently. And we are calling you today to refund your money back as we are shutting down our business. Press 1 to get the refund. Press 2 if you have... Which is some kind of tech refund there on the thing. Received the refund from us already. Press 3 if you do not wish to get the refund from us. Their VoIP is a bit clippy, isn't it? Press 4 if you want to be added in DNC list. I repeat, this is an emergency call from your computer support company, so please do not hang up the call. As per our records, you have paid for your computer technical support recently. And we yeah, I'm just going to dial it up.
Okay, I'm starting to think there's something wrong with my VoIP, with my text now. Hello, Bashful. Hello, Kaz. Okay. Because that's, that's the third number now where it's uh, glitched out like that. <clears throat> if possible, can I shift the live timing just a bit earlier? It's past midnight there. Oh, okay. Yeah, um... You know, that's the problem with live streaming. You you can't like just do it. Well, I can't just do it twenty four hours because I'm just one person. I mean, it would be nice to do like a twenty four hour thing, but yeah, I'm I'm not DVR. I ain't got the uh, I ain't got the resources or or anything. I'm just one one doggo. Hello, Jonathan. It's the whiskers. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to change my uh, make doge bigger. I think I might be able to do that. Give me a moment. Make doge bigger. Where's my doge cam? Is that it? Ready. Enlarge. There we go. Is that better? Very good. Clone myself? Would I be able to clone myself, Ginger? Maybe. Should we... Uh, have a little go, let me ooh, go over here. Ready, cloning, cloning, cloning. Oh, no, that's resize. Cloning, two of me. Eh. There we go. Lovely. Did I have a good weekend? Yeah, not, not bad. Not bad at all. Very good. Right, yes, I was going to try from a different VoIP, wasn't I? So let me grab the number I was dialing, which is this one. Okay, copy that. And then where are we? Got to put it into my other VoIP. One moment, please. All right, is it dial in? I, d I don't know if it dial in. Yeah, it's just caller ID. Hello? The phone number is currently busy. Nah. That number's currently busy, so it may actually not be my uh, my VoIP that's the issue. Okay, we're, we're going to go back to one doggo. One moment, please. There we are. Back down it. There we go. Lovely. A pack of doges. Exactly. That's how I'm able to do the old... um. The different angles nowadays you see i got this angle here and then i got this angle here the two different two different camera angles very good <clears throat> okie dokie you see 50 doges well you'll be able to see quite a few doges if i put it on this one because then you got me in the uh in the screen up there malta thanks for that that's very kind of you Okay. Hello, Dr. Phil. Hope you're doing all right. All right, hero. Um, come on. Where's the next number? This next number is from Joe. It's, it's a Scanson number. We'll try that. Two doggo bonus. 38 doggies. Lovely. Right. New call and paste. Hello. Thank you for reaching on the customer support. This is Lena. How can I help you? Hello, Rena. Yes. Uh, could you cancel an order for me, please? 
Hello, sorry. Could you cancel an order? Make a pardon. Cancel an order for me, please. Um, can you hold for a second so that I can check which order is that? Okay, yeah. <laughs> So do you know which order was that? I think which it was order? for an apple thing. Apple thing? Apple what? An apple. Apples? I don't think it was an apple. I think it was like a MacBook Pro. Okay. You ordered that? No, I didn't order it, but it, it's on my account. Okay, it's on your account. Okay, yeah. just stay on hold, I'm checking it. Okay. Thanks for holding the line, sir. Yes. Yeah, I just checked and as I can see, there is the purchase on iPhone 11, right? Which is $799? Yeah, but I, I didn't make an order. Okay. The order has been placed from different locations. That is Dayton, Ohio. Do you know anyone from Dayton, Ohio? Who Dayton? That's just down the road, I'm in Toledo. Yeah. Okay, no worries. Yeah, I bet it's it my ex-wife. Is it my ex-wife? Okay, no worries. Sorry? Is it my ex-wife? Is this your ex-wife? Ex well, it, it could be. She lives in Dayton. Oh, she lives in Dayton. Uh, yeah. You can ask her if she might be out of this. All right. Well, do you yeah, have the delivery the... address there? Sorry? Do you have delivery address? Delivery address? Yes. So we are not a place to Because then the I could find out where she is at the moment. Yeah. Um, sorry, sir, but we are not a to say any of your personal details over the phone call because this call is recording for training and monitoring purpose. Look, I'm just if asking you, if you know her address. Yeah. Okay, you do know the address. Yeah, sorry, sir, but if it's not... But you can't disclose if it. If it's not you, we can... Yeah, sorry, but if it's not you, we cannot disclose any of their... Any of her personal information. Oh, all right. If it's not you, then. You still there? Sorry, sir, but... Yeah, sorry, sir, but you can ask her first of all, and... Okay. You can call us back later. Okay, can you just cancel the order? Because she's not supposed to be on the account anymore. You need to ask her. Yes, but if she placed an order, she's not allowed to, you see, because of security purpose. Okay, do you want us to cancel this order? Yes. Okay, we will cancel this order, and so you will have to cancel this order by through your phone or by your computer. By 3 p.m.? What happens at 3 p.m.? Uh, because we have to send an ID and we need to connect with Amazon security server. Okay, but what, what's, the, what's this got to do about three o'clock? Uh, sorry, my pardon. You said uh, something about 3 p.m. I, I, I don't know what happens at 3 p.m. 3 p.m.? Yeah, didn't you say something about 3 p.m.? I didn't say anything. We, like, we need to connect you with Amazon Security Server, sir. And by through your computer, we have need to connect with Amazon Security Server, and we will send you an ID to cancel that order. Otherwise, we cannot cancel this order because if it uh, is not you who ordered it. Well, no, but it's my account, so just cancel it if it's my account. Yes, sir. But yes. if it's not you, then you need to connect with Amazon Security Server to cancel that order. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, just tell me, how do you work the internet? Is that your computer or laptop or cell phone? Well, I, I got compu I got a computer. I do sometimes make a few uh, purchases on it. Okay, on a computer? Yes, on the computer. Okay, is that your Mac computer or Windows? Look, I don't, I don't know who Mac is, but I, I just got a normal computer. I don't know anything else. Okay, now where can you go in front of your computer? Oh, I come in my computer all the time. 
and to just every in front of your computer and I will transfer the scroll to my senior supervisor. All right. They will help you further, okay? They'll okay. Yes, they'll help it. Okay, now. Okay. Just be on hold. Oh, let's I'm on hold. Tell me what you want, what you, you really, really, really want. Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I want a sprinkler test. Hello. Thank you for holding the line. You have transferred to the senior technician. How Harold. Oh, yes. Okay. Um, can you cancel the order then? Yeah. Okay. So, sir, um, yeah, I just go ahead and cancel it. you the reason why I got the call, right? Oh, all right. Yes. All right, sir. So now, just be in front of the computer, okay? And just let me know the computer which you use. Is that a Windows or a Mac computer? A uh, window. Oh, it's the Windows, okay. Yeah. So, would you please tell me, like, which browser do you browse with? Oh, well, I, I got Firefox. Firefox, okay. So, yeah. just open up your Firefox. Why would I open up a Firefox? Because, sir, as my junior colleague says, told you that you're going to need to get connected with the Amazon security server, all right? Okay, yes. So open up your Firefox. Okay, I, I got it open. Okay. Yeah. So on your top of the screen, can you see a long search bar where you type to search? A long search. Well, there's one in the middle of the of the thingy. Is it yeah, Google? Yeah. Okay. Now, are sir, you feeling lucky that one? Yeah. Yes. Exactly. Mm. Okay. Okay, now, sir, over there, type down www. www. Yeah. T. T as in Thomas. T. E as in Echo. T. A as in Alpha. Yeah. M as in Mother. T Brewer. Yeah, teamviewer.com. Oh, oh, team viewer. Okay, well, I had the, um, I had a tea brewer, didn't I? I brought that to what last yeah, month on Amazon. Team... Yeah, it's teamviewer.com, okay? Dot com. T E A M. Yeah, V I E W E R. Dot B I E W. Yeah. Uh, okay. I've gone to the website. It's asking me for re okay, remote access support. Yeah. Now, just down below, can you see uh, download oh, for free? Uh, download. Oh, no. Nope. Something's happened there. Sing it. Proof is in the hard. Na 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 na. Proof is in the hard. Na 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 na. Okay. To apply all changes, the system uh, has to be restarted. No. Okay, what it says? Uh, it, it says, uh, Team Viewer has been detected on the computer. It, it's got a little pop up, eh? Okay, now, uh, you like can a pop up? Yeah, okay, or accept. Okay, or accept. Yeah, so can you see that? So yes. Got OK. You will click on that. Two scam here. No sprinklers, please. All right. Tests. Yeah. OK. Now, can you see the Team Viewer Setup EXE.com? Yeah, you will click on that. A click on it? OK. Yeah. Yes, OK. So, so we got the thing. Yeah, now just yeah, give good. a click on default okay. installation. User, okay. user account and control. 
Are you the one who wants to access yeah. the computer? Is it going to change on the hard drive? Yeah, it, you would click on allow, enable or accept the key. Uh, allow. For the security. Allow. Yeah, allow. Yeah, you would okay. click on allow. Yes. I don't know if he just got disconnected there. 54 year old British man, yes. Absolutely. Where are we? Got so many things open right now. Hello, Christine Hunter. I think, yeah, I think they've, uh, I think it's a network thing. Uno momento. Yeah, just got a missed call from them. They'll call me back, though. They'll call me back. Because they want to get the monies. In the bank account. Do you know the money's in the bank account? I don't. Okay, so while we wait for them to call back, I want to thank the uh, few super chats that have been coming through from Katarina, Malta, Eric, Joe, and Robert. Thanks. Thanks for that. I'll give you a proper shout out at the end of the stream. Yeah, they'll, they'll call back any moment. Maybe I should call them. Maybe I should call them. Deep pockets. It's a crackerhead Ted. You see the thing, the earth from the moon, yes. And Robert is pointing at some thumbs up. Yep, don't forget to twiddle your thumbs here. Can't even speak now. Don't forget to twiddle your thumbs. Lovely. We're going to call it back. Just ain't calling us. Oh, thanks, uh, F, F, P, H, S, S, T, H, P, O, K. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that. Hello, Stephen. I don't think we can throw on the number, though. Let's give it another try. No, we're not getting through for some reason. That's a shame. It isn't a real photo of the moon and the earth, I, I guess, this much. I mean, who, who would fly all the way to the moon to get their DSLR out and uh, take a quick snap? And then drive back. I mean, fly back even. I mean, who drives to the moon? Not unless you're uh, Elon Musk in one of his weird cars. Okay, that, that's... I don't think we're having much luck on this number. We're going to try something else. Give me a moment. Yes, we're going to try... What, what's the next number? The next number is uh, SSA. Okay. Try the SSA. Try and get twenty-two pounds, eh? And twenty-two pounds of delicious seven American cocaine. I don't even know if we're getting through. Let's try again. Hope it's not the text now glitching out again. Yeah, it might be network. Okay, so we're gonna try a different one. You use virtual box. I'm currently using virtual box because i'm like running a vm in a vm on an arch host yes, it's, it's all over the place okay. okay give me a moment guys i'm trying to sort out the next one apparently this one has better lights do doggo bonus. And I don't know why, but um, lately the alerts have been popping up all over the shops, and you know, even though nothing's Dollar, happening. Dollar I think I may have to end up turning case. these alerts off. Tell me what you want, it, what you really, out. really want. Tell me what you want, what you really, really right, want. Yes. I want a sprinkler test. Hello, MV. Yeah, you see, it's, it's just doing the same stuff over and over again. Sing it. Groove is in the hard na 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 na. Groove is in the hard na 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 na. Any more collab? Oh, yeah, I'm. Um, okay, just set this thing play and then I'll, I'll mention about collaboration. Is that all done now? I think that's all done. Yeah, as for collaborations, um. You know, there's there's a few 
things in the background nothing is confirmed yet but uh it may be something coming up in april that's that's all i can say so far you didn't know you started yes we're starting um we're starting an hour earlier for everybody around the world apart from the americans because the americans they they do something mental with their um daylight savings time all i know is that it isn't it's not the same as british summertime that's for sure his name is boop and my name is bop very good okay let's move on let's move on i'm gonna open up the uh hello sands hello john it's cray cray yeah whatever cray cray is and Finley Cray, I think he sang a song. Not quite sure what it was though, because it was the 90s and I was high. Okay. The next number is SSA. Let me just copy that. And... Stay it in. MST... Oh, is that a uh, mountain... mountain time? I don't know. Always get a bit mixed up between central time and mountain time. Oh, no. I mean, it's not like in Britain where you just have one time zone. It's ringing. And they've hung up. Okay, let me try another number. Yes, yeah, so I've always got like little things going on in the background. Okay, so we've got uh, an Amazon number here. Give it a go. Will you <laughs> give you a shout out if I scratch your belly? Very good there. Hello, Sean Conway. Thanks for that. I'm sure that'll pop up any moment now. Hello, Brenda. Paste this number in. And dial. Clocks forward and backwards is a pain in the UK. Yes, it certainly is. But I'll tell you one thing, when I'm checking out my old GameStop stomps now. A pirate gets his ears pierced for a buccaneer. Very good, yeah, when I'm checking out my old GameStop, my shares in that going up and down, I can do it an hour earlier, so that's all good. Ah, you're sending numbers on Skype, thanks for that. Here we go, dial this one now. Apropos of nothing. Who used to do that? Was that Victor Lewis Smith? Curious about where my accent... Whatever. South of England. Don't want to give too much away. now yep 28th of March for us oh thanks for the uh, never gonna give there. you up never gonna let you down never gonna run around and desert you you having tests regularly at the moment yeah it's never good is it but as long as they all come back negative this guy ain't picking up You're north of Antarctica. Very good, very good. Disadvantage is that we lose an hour's sleep. Well, Sonic, uh, uh, I haven't really been sleeping much lately. Okay. Hello, Gareth. Gareth not. I don't know, I always tend to be a bit, not Scottish, Welsh when I try and say Gareth. Okay, give me a moment. We're going to... Then what the hell's just happened? Got a blue 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 thing. W W W W dot dot W W W Ah, you like the new office there, Sands? Yeah. I thought you know, it gets some different camera angles going and whatnot. I heard somewhere that it helps with the algorithm, the old AI can pick up different camera angles, so that's all good. Alright, there, Vince. Up there in uh, 
the Geordie part of the world. No dill hole. Arizona does not observe daylight savings. I never knew that. Mind you, I don't know anything about Arizona. Let's move on. Getting the next number ready. Una momento. Uh, I'm not sure if I've already tried this, but it's a, an SSA number. Apparently much bigger than a police officer. Do I support a football team? Not really, no. No, I've uh, never been one who's been interested much in, in football. Good point, Tunes. Good point. Hello, Blast from the past. Don't know if you find these all right. Hello, Star Chaser. A pirate gets his Your family supports for a Man United. Yeah, I think that's like the uh, generic go to supporting thing. You see people all around the world with Man United shirts on. Crazy, crazy stuff. Okie dokie. Might as well try the next one. Not having much luck on the numbers so far. One moment while we double check some stuff over here. Here's one. I don't think I've tried it, so I'll give it a go. SSA. Answered one second ago. Uh, oh, okay, Simone. I'll try those next. <clears throat> no, Liverpool. Yeah, there's a lot of Liverpool people about as well. You get your jab tomorrow. Good luck with that, Gareth. Don't give up. Exactly. Never give up. Hello, you dummy. What a good name, isn't it? Yeah, this one ain't gonna be picking up. So we've got Microsoft uh, refund. Okay. Oh, Coventry City. Nice. I think I've only ever visited Coventry once. And that's only because I had a university course up there. Mind you, what was that? That, that must have been 20 years ago now. Blimey, I mean, now time does fly. Pick up the phone, pick up the phone. Do one thing and pick up We are the... not able to take your call right ah. now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Uh, Finch UK, is it, if it is a UK number, um, I'd have to get my, uh, my UK VoIP out. You all get. <laughs> you all get. I like it. I like it. So I'm going to pop on to Bobbit and... Uh, I wouldn't say I'm that young. I mean, I'm coming up to uh, the big 4 0. That'll be sometime this year. Right. Let me just refresh these numbers. Pick up the phone. It's just connecting. Youngin. Get this valuable number today at 800.com or by texting 800 800 9038. Okay, so. Don't know what's going on in that number. Apparently it's for sale. It's 800 800 800 800 800 800 800 So we're going to try... Uh, oh, Depeche Mode fan. Nice. Investigation Department of Social Security Administration. How can I help you? Yeah, I got your message there. I'm a voicemail. Okay, so when did we receive the call? Uh, well, it said it came through 20 minutes ago on my, my voicemail. Uh-huh. Don't okay, know what time so you sent receive... it, though. I'm sorry, ma'am? I don't know what time you sent it, but the thing is on the thing. It, it just come through 20 minutes. Okay, 
So, ma'am, uh, did we receive any kind of a case ID number when we receive any call? Uh, I couldn't make it out because there's a lot of noise in the background and they're all muffler. There's not a lot of noise, ma'am. No, I mean on a voicemail. All right. Oh, okay. So, ma'am, uh, okay, so just help me out with your first name and last name so that I can pull out with your case file over here on my system. Yeah, it's Robert. McDonald. R O V E R T. Robert, right? Yeah, Robert. Uh huh. And what is your last name? McDonald. M C, right? Yeah, that right. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Uh, um. Uh oh. Okay, McDonald. Yeah. Uh, just hold on. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. McDonald. And have verified me with your zip code? Yeah, 43613. 43? Hold on the line. Let me just pull out with the case file over here on my system. Your assistant? Yes. Thank you for holding the line. Yeah. Right now, Mrs. Robert, the reason now I can see here that the reason that you're having an arrest warrant issue under your name is because there's a drug trafficking and money laundering case under your social. Are you aware about that? No, I, I don't know about that. Okay. So help me out with just the last four digit number with your social number. 1942. One eight four two. No, one nine four two. Oh, one nine four two. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Marcus. Hello. Yeah. Okay, ma'am. Are you aware that you have a drug trafficking and money laundering case under your social? No. When did this happen? Mhm. Mm okay. When? Now I'm gonna. Ex I'm sorry. When? Yeah. Uh, since uh, the last two, three months ago. Two or three months? I, I don't know what, what mm -hmm. what's going on. We try, yeah, we trying to reach you, but we didn't get you, okay, ma'am? So now I'm going to explain to you regarding the case, okay? So now I want you to grab a piece of paper and a pen. Oh, okay, one moment. Mm-hmm. All right, ma'am. You can uh -huh. write my first... My first name is Alan and my last name is Williams. Alan Williams. Alan. Mm-hmm. William. And your case ID number, yes. And your case ID number, it's DC, D is in Delta, C is in Charlie. 6884. 6884. Yes, and my registration ID number, it's GS, G is in Government, S is in Sam. Nine seven two four two one. Nine seven two four two one. Correct. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, can you just verify me? What is uh, my name, my registration ID number, and your case ID number? Uh, Alan Williams, DC six eight eight four, GS nine seven two four two one. All right. So now I'm going to explain to you regarding the case, all right? So I want you do not interrupt me while between I'm solving the case, all right? And I'm going to give you a spare chance while between I finish to solve the case. Is that clear? All right. Okay. Now, the reason that you're having a drug trafficking case is because we found a complaint which was launched by the landowner who received in the city of Roland. The complaint was that the apartment, which was under the landowner, name it was rented under one individual. But as they passed it, there were 10 to 15 people recording on the address. So he was quite suspicious about the activities. Therefore, he complained the local sheriff department of the state of Texas. Now, once the complaint was launched, the sheriff department rented the apartment. Once they entered, they found an illegal substance, like cocaine, 
Mary Joanna, Crystal Man, and also Heroin. Now, since involved drugs, they involved the U.S. Drugs Enforcement, along with the FBI and the U.S. Marshal, along with those illegal substances. They found out a delivery address along with the car name, Fort Series Simi Truck. When they tried to get a hold of the Simi Truck, they found out it was registered under your social. Therefore, you are charged with the drug trafficking. Now, we also we get a complaint from the state of Texas. We get a complaint from the Bank of American Bank, Chase Bank, and also Wells Fargo starting that there were 10 bank accounts made under your social. Not only that, we also found a 15 credit card applied under your social with an approximation limit of $1,500,000 each. And we also believe that the bank account and the drugs which we found through a burden car has the same connection. According to the U.S. Drugs Enforcement Administration at station number 28, under UFC Code 134, it is said by the code house that this criminal activities is performed by one individual or one individual or his nation. So now, I would like to ask you that, are you the person that doing all these criminal activities? No, I, I don't do no, I don't do no drugs. I, I, I've never dealt in drugs since, uh, since high school. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. then, uh, if you're not a... Yeah, if you're not a person that's doing all these criminal activities, that means someone is misusing with your identity. Okay, so now I would like to ask you, have you ever shared any personal information to anyone? Uh, no, just just uh, just uh, normal people like my ex-wife. She, she knows my social number and my blood group, but, um, you, you, you know, I, I haven't spoken to her in five years now. Okay, so Mr. Robert. The reason now, since you're doing the fact you don't have any criminal activities, you're related with the crime. You have to prove yourself that you're not sin because the crime has been committed under your social. Therefore, I would like to fax down all the physicals and the assets to the courthouse. So now critics are going to ask you some questions, but I need the answer and most honest answer. Is that clear? All right. Okay. Now, I would like to ask you that have you ever lost a wallet in the past? Uh, yeah, I, I did lose my wallet. What was it? Um, when two, was two years ago? It was two years ago. I lost my wallet. Two years ago, okay? Yeah. So, do you rent a car under your name? Have you ever rented a car under your name? Uh, the last time I rented a car was uh, when I had my old car in, in the shop because that had broke down totally. The big end had gone. And so, I had to rent a car. I had to, I had to rent it for about a week. Then I just ended up buying a oh. new one. Oh, okay. So now I would like to ask you, Mr. Robert, do you own a car under your name? Yeah, I, I have a car now. How many cars do you have under your name? Well, just one car. One. And do you have any property under your name? Well, I have my house. You have your You own it, right? Yeah, I, I own the house, right, because... Uh, I was able to pay it off because I had some of that Bitcoin and that went up in price and I would just pay the whole thing off. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so now, yeah, now, Mr. Robert, the reason now, like I can, I told you, like we have found more than 10 bank accounts under your name. We need to make sure that which bank is the genuine bank account and which bank is the fake bank account. So I need to make sure that which bank, how many banks do you have under your name? Uh, well, I have a check-in and a shavings account, and that is with, uh, Welsh Fargo. And then I got another one at Bank of America, but that's, that's only savings. Okay, in this Bank of America, you have a saving or checking? Uh, just saving. Just saving. And what about in Welsh Fargo? Uh, checking and saving in that one. Okay, so now uh, I would like to ask you that uh, in this American bank, each bank account, we have found more than $50,000 each bank account. So I believe that in your saving account in the American bank, how much is your available balance do you have? Uh, well, last time I checked, I had 67000 67000 the yeah. last time you checked, right? Yeah. And what about in your Wells Fargo, in your saving account? In the savings account on that one, I got, uh, what is it, 26500 I beg your pardon? 
26,500. 26,500, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and what about in your checking account? Well, in my checking account, I got, well, uh, last time I checked was about $1,200. $1,200. Mm hmm. Okay, and uh, now, do you own any credit card on the Yoni? No, I, I don't trust those credit cards. Uh-huh. Yeah, I, I used, I used to have any... one back in the 90s, but, you know, they, they said you, it, it's free, it's interest-free, you don't have to pay the bastard. Then 18 months later, they slapped 34.9% APR on the bastard. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so now, do, do you have a 401k or IRA? No, I don't have those either. I put all my money into the game stump. Okay. So now, uh, okay, Mr. Robert, uh, let me just give this information to the courthouse and the U.S. Treasury, all right? I just want you to be on the line. All right. Thank you for holding the line. Are you there? I'm still here, yeah. Okay, so Mr. Robert, the reason now I've got information from the courthouse and U.S. Treasury that my job is done as I have committed as my responsibility. Therefore, in order to calculate the case, I would like to transfer this call to the DEA officer as a Drugs Enforcement Administration. He is an authorized person that he can help you, all right? So I want you to be honest with him, okay, Mr. Robert? Okay. Okay. Thanks for being online. Thanks for being patient. Your call has been transferred to the DEA department. This is Officer David Dow with the batch ID GS7209. And I believe I'm talking to uh, Robert, Robert Daniel. Uh, Robert McDonald. McDonald, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, so you were talking to one of my junior officers regarding with the case file, and I believe he have already explained to you everything, like what's all happening under your name. Yeah, I was speaking to Alan Williams. He told me that mm -hmm. there's some uh, drugs being dealt under my name. Yes. And uh, did the officer told you there is an arrest warrant issued under your name? Yeah, but it's not me. I ain't done no drugs since, uh, like I said, way back in high school. Okay. And uh, let me tell you, I'm the DEA officer, and I'm the investigating officer of your case. So, I would like to know, like, have you ever lost your personal information in your past, or might be you have shared uh, your personal information to any third person? Well, uh, I mentioned to Alan that I, I lost my wallet two years ago now. Two years ago? Yeah. Okay, and have you filed a complaint for that? Well, uh... I didn't know I had to. Okay. So that's not a problem. I'll be helping you in this case. Okay. Okay. So now, uh, first of all, uh, I'll be starting the preparation for your documentation. I believe you have got driving license, right? Yeah, I got a driving license. Okay. So I want you to get a picture of your driving license and send me on a number which I will provide you. Okay, so that I can attach it with your case file and I can start the preparation for your case file. Okay, and I can also remove your name from this case of yours. Okay. All right. Do you have a pen and a paper with you right now? Oh, don't. Couldn't you just use my driving license number? Uh, no, I need to have a picture of your driving license. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll send you a picture. Yeah. Uh, no. Do you have a pen and a paper? You can note the number down. Yeah, I got pen and paper. What, do I not send it to this number? Yeah. No, no, I need to give you the other number. It is, uh, are you ready? Uh-huh. It is 210. 210. 969. 969. 9368. Yes. So can you please confirm the number once? Uh, okay. So the last four numbers are 93686. No, it's 9368. Nine, oh, oh, this, oh, it's 9368. I'm getting confused there. Yes, and uh, can you please confirm the whole number? Oh, yeah, it's uh, 210969 The number ends with 9368. 
Okay, you don't oh. need to be confused. It's simple, 9368, okay? 6A. Yes, now can you please confirm the number once again? Yeah, it's a 210-969-9368. Perfect. Now you need mm -hmm. to get a picture of your driving license and send me on this number. My driver's okay, license? Okay, I'm holding the line for you. Yes. Oh, I, yeah. Uh, uh, once you're done, let mm -hmm. me know. Okay, I'm holding the line for you. Hold the line. Uh, let me sort that out or take this photograph. Not quite sure how do you do it. Am I able to do it to a different number if I'm if I got you on the line? No, I I I want you to send it on this number which I provided you. Okay. Ooh, yeah, but I'm already speaking to you on this one. Do I need to hang up the You're phone in order to text someone else? No, you are talking to me on the other line, and I've given you some other number. You need to send on the other number which I gave you. Well, I, I need it's to two one zero. Yeah, I, I got the number, but it's a different number from this one. So how can I talk to you and send a text from the same phone to a different number? Okay. Like you're not able to do that? Well, I, I don't know. I mean, if I'm talking to you on one line, if I've only got my mobile okay. here, my, my cell phone, how can I send a text to a different number at the same time? Okay. That's good. Well, let me try it out anyway. Okay. Uh huh. Right, and now I send a photo. Wait, wait, I'm just scrolling through. There we go. There's the camera. And send. All right. I I send a photo to the num. You still on the line? Hello? Yes. Yeah, I sent you a photo. Which photo have you sent me? Uh, well, it's, it, I just took the photo of the camera of, you know, of the, um, uh, of driving license. Yes, what are you trying to do? What do you mean, why do am I trying Do you think this is a joke? No, I don't think it's do you a think joke. This is you want to get arrested? Oh, not unless it's by a woman. Put me in handcuffs. Uh, Spank me. Woman. You want a woman or you want a cop? You want a cop? You, you want, want a, a coke? coke? A big a coke, a smile and shut yes. up. You want a big fat <laughs> right? I beg your pardon. There's no need for words like that. Motherfucker. You don't seem to be very professional on this line. Yes, I am. No, you're not, because you've leaked the N-word and then you said MF. I mean, that's bloody Terry Mackey, eh? Hey, Bodhisiki? Hello? Hello, anyone there? Anyone at all? Are you there? I'm there. Where are you? Are you on GBO? You on GBO, motherfucker? Hey, you're, you're on GB Road. Yourself. Hey, you're Honda. Yo, T Yo, Hero Honda. No, not Honda. Yes. You're Honda. Yeah, Mary Honda. Yes, you're London, right? Uh, you're a Chute, you're Chute. boy. You know that? Yes, you're Mackie Chute, right? Hey, you're Teddy Mackie you Chute. Are... You're Teddy Banky Chute. Yeah, bro. Yeah, Bhushri wale. Yeah, Mada Chot. Tum the Mada Chot, eh, Bhushri wala. Okay. Where do you want to tell Come to India, bro. I'll, I'll tell you what you need to do. Oh. Tup dea. Da yop sa da spet. Ta? Oh. Bien. Hello? Hello? Yes. How is up, man? Yeah, that yeah, Randy Cho. Who's Randy Cho? You, Randy Cho. That that guy speaking to you, Randy Cho. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Randy mm -hmm. Termai. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
You care? Mm-hmm. You wanna suck my cock? Mm-hmm. What do you mean? You are a... You are Randy Church, right? Hey, Talk you're Randy India, Church, head of mine. Have you been in boy. India? I'm your pop. I'm not... I'm not Bihari. You're I Bihari. I know you're Bihari. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You are Angreji. Ah, are you Angreji, right? You're a Gandu boy. Yes, Gandu boy, right? Yes, Gandu you're a Gandu boy. boy. Yes, yes. Exactly. Mm. Hey, you mother chud, go and fuck yourself, you motherfucker. Ha 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 ha. Motherfucker. Ha, motherfucker. We are not able to take your call right now. Goodbye. And they hung up. <clears throat> right, first of all, I want to apologize for, um, for the scammer using the particular word that could very well get me banned off this platform. I think we all know what it means. Oh, they called him. Well, someone's calling me back. One moment, please. Hello. Hello. This is Officer Michael Brown from Social Security Administration to inform you that due to some suspicious activities related to your social security number, we are forced to suspend your social security number with immediate effect. In case you feel this is an error, you may connect to the legal department of Social Security Administration. In order to connect a Social Security Administration officer, press 1. In case we did not hear from you, your social... Thank you for calling Social Security Administration. This is Officer Samuel Parker. How can I assist you? Yeah there, Parker. Uh, I just press 1 on Tang Tao. Hello. Yeah, I just press 1. Did you receive any voice call or voicemail? Yeah, they told me to press 1 to get through to you. Did you receive any reference number or any case ID in the call or voicemail? No, I just press 1. Okay, can you verify your first name and last name? Yeah, it's Robert McDonald. Robert? Yeah. Spell it, please. R O B E R T, Robert, and then McDonald. That's big M, little C, big D, O N A L D. McDonald. And they hung up. I don't know why they hung up. Yes, uh, some of you earlier were asking for me to use the soundboard. At the moment, I'm unable to do that because there's some weird thing here with the audio setup. It won't allow um. It won't allow one browser source to react with another browser source. I've got some weird stuff going on with the hardware at the moment, but it's okay because you know I've got some stuff on delivery, like some audio cables and. Uh, extra inputs and whatnot so hopefully if that arrives uh tomorrow say i'll be i should have it ready for the um ready for thursday's live stream or hello uh jeff mcleod dizzy ivy may lufa desi dadu there's so many new people popping into chat here all the time random dude 19 Good to see so many of you here. Okay. I'm going to call that number back and see what's going on. Oh. We've gone blop. It's no good, is it? Fair enough. Fair enough. Tony, don't reply. Oh. Hello, Tony. Your guitar, dude. Nice. See Skype. Yes, I'm. I'm looking at Skype now for the next number. Hello, graphic. Would you like to call from Utah, or have? Oh, John Wayne Gacy. Very tasty. 
Noah says, where am I from? I'm from England. Dan Sayre. Okay, so this is a uh, Amazon Answers, okay. Paste it and dial. Goldfinger, he's a man. Hey. Hello, is this Amazon? Hey. Is this Amazon? Hello, thank you for calling Amazon. How can I help? How can I help you, sir? Well, I got a message hey. about. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I hear me. Okay. Yes, I got a message I from hear you. Me, sir. Yes, I hear you. I'm trying to tell you why I called. Hello. Hello. I got a message from you. It said that there'd been an order. For a wheelbarrow or a shell. No, it was it was for an iPhone. Back there, ma, ka, bol tera ma ko bhi chodenge, tiko bhi chodenge, randiya bachcha. What are you saying? What I'm saying is, tumra ma ka bhur. Well, I don't know who that is. Tumra ma leti lappa. Mare ma leti lappa. Papa. Wasn't that from a Renault Clio advert? No, it's not Papa. You, you got Nicole no, and Papa, Papa. What and I'm Vic and is, Bob. No, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is, I'm a bull. You got a bull? No, my ma got a bull. Terry's ma got a bull. We are not able to take your call right now. Goodbye. Hey, that was a little strange. Boogie doogie woogie. Gotta cancel this order. But apparently Terry's ma has got a ball. Hello? Hello? Hello, who's this? Yeah, thank This is Amazon. Thank you for connecting Amazon. Yes, can yes. you cancel an order? Can you cancel my order, please? Yeah, I will cancel, but sir, I need your help to cancel. I will send you a cancellation form. Then you have to fill up by your own age. Then we can cancel and refund your C49, okay? Okay. So just being in front of a laptop, I will send you a cancellation form, sir. Well, I am in front of it. Really, sir? Yes, I got it right here. Just open up a Google Chrome. A Google. Okay, there we go. What website do you want to go to? Just For type over there www dot three w then dot www dot three w dot. That like R S. No no no. Uh, I think it's like R S. You got R S W W W, and then dot com. Oh my god! Just listen to me. Okay. No dot com. You fucking asshole. There's no need for that. We are not able to take your call right now. Goodbye. Hello? Hello? Yeah, thanks for being connected with Amazon. This is Mike Page. How may I help you, sir? Yes, Mike. Uh, could you cancel an order for me? Uh... Chris, uh, no problem, but uh, let me ask you just one question, sir. Do you have any internet connection over there? Yeah, i got that super fast mega fiber broadband thing. Oh, wow, that is very good. Yeah, they say, they say it's fiber to the house. We are not able to take your call right now. Goodbye. Okay. Give it another try. Yeah, they are very triggered today, aren't they? Crazy guys. Hello? Hello? Yes, is it, can, can we get this sorted out or what? Bloody music. Take your call right now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, so we're not getting for that number now. I don't think they like me very much. <sighs> okay. Oh, apologies for yawning there. Harry Crack. Very good, very good.
Yeah, you got some big babies today, exactly, they do. Okay, let's try the next one. Just uh, opening up the social medias, making sure I've got messages and whatnot. Might as well open up my uh, my email because I think somebody sent something on there. Ah, phone number from Fence Banks. Ah, yes, that's the that's the UK number, isn't it? Yes. Let me see if I can't dial that from my UK voice. Or should I even try it from my text now? Would it work through text now? I don't know. Give it a try. As we can receive UK numbers on the text now. So plus four four. And then space and drop the zero. Wonder if this will work. No, straight to hang up. But we were getting through. Yeah. Because apparently it was costing me two cents a minute. So yeah, we, we may try that in future. Um, dialing a few UK numbers from a US VoIP in the UK. Crazy stuff. Hello, Flight 666. Hope you're doing all right. Yes, to be honest, I didn't think we'd get through it this time of night. Because, you know, it's, 20, it's quarter past eight here in the UK. And uh, they tend to phone up during the daytime when... Uh, when little old ladies are by themselves and whatnot, and they say, "Hello, we are calling from bloody uh, white good insurance and yeah, so on and so forth." Let me get the next. Actually, instead of getting the next number, I'm gonna try from Bob. Always around lunchtime. Yeah, I'll try tech support. My Microsoft. Ah, oh, thanks, uh, Jay's new account. Moving. Hello, Jamie. Nine one. The number you dialed is not in service. Where can you find UK numbers? If you go to, you know, type into Google who called me and then UK, you should be able to find a couple of websites where you'll be able to check numbers and whatnot. 1440p doggo, yeah, 1440p. I think I'm the only one who who streams in this resolution. God knows why. Just got home from a collapsed technical issue. Oh. Oh, okay, flight. Good to see there's no fatalities. 145 watching. Yeah, that's that's not bad, is it? Hello, Tammy. Hope you're doing all right. Hope everybody's all right. Um. <clears throat> So crisp, yes. Very high definition. Much HD. Okay, phone book. Generic tech support. Here we go. Hello, Steve. Thank you for calling. If you know the extension of the party you are trying to reach, please enter it now. Otherwise, please remain on the line while your call is transferred. Yes, how may I help you? Oh, yes, can you help out uh, the technician stuff, yes? No, no, we don't deal in pop-ups. What kind of pop-up you're talking about? I never said pop-up. You said pop-up. I, I was asking for techni technical help. What's your name, motherfucker? No need for words like that. When you're phoning up for some assistance on the computer, put me through to your bop. No, we don't. We don't give any assistance on computers, you asshole. No, because I'm your bop. And you fuck don't you. tell your father how to fuck. Ask your mom, she will tell you. <laughs> you still there? You don't have any other tongue? You don't have a mother tongue? No, because you've been drinking Desi Dado, haven't you? Mm, yeah. Yes. Yes, you're you're on the GB road you're under. Mm, yes. Yes, exactly. You've had too much dizzy dalu and you've passed out on GB road. Mm, mm, mm. Yes. You need some dollars not to call us? No, I don't need dollars. I've got twenty seven do lakh. 
You will never see a lack in your life, will you? Small boy. <laughs> I already have it. I already have it. But you have a lack. I find yeah, that very I, difficult I have to believe. Curls. I have in curls. You have curls? What, curls I... in your hair? Do you wear a wig? No. In my account, I have curls. You understand curls? You, you Maybe have, not. You have curls. Maybe you don't earn that much. I don't know what you're on about curlers. I'm talking about curls. C-R-O-R-E-S. You have kernels. Mm -hmm. Colonel I Sanders. have millions and millions of fun. You just have lacks, that's it. Why not? What's wrong with lack? Sorry? What's wrong with lack? You don't like lack? Um, I have lots of. You have losses? Well, if you're losing money, why don't you invest in that Bitcoin? Fuck you. Okay? No. You don't want to tell your father how to look. No? I don't know what he was on about there, colonels or carols or curlers. Bloody babbless, eh? <clears throat> Somebody saying, stop stealing my jokes. So if anybody does know what the hell he was on about, please say so in chat. Good to see you here, my pixie dust. Hope you're doing all right. Sandy's doing all right. Yep. Yeah. He's not the brightest tool in the shed, but he is a tool. He is a tool. Is it normal for them to be angry so fast? I don't know. I think sometimes it happens because, you know, uh, I speak with a slightly English accent and they don't like that. They they only want to scam the Americans for some reason. They do, I mean, I've had them personally say, I don't like the British accent. And I say, I'm not the British accent. And yeah. Star Chaser sent me a mail. Thanks for that. I'm sure I'll take a second to look at that. Oh, funny names. Yeah, thanks for that. I'll make a note of those. Yes. <clears throat> okay. Let me search for another number. On a momento. On a momento. Apologies for the dead air while I get the next number. Ah, Blast. Thanks for the uh, John Wayne Gacy. Very good. Yes, he was an interesting character. In fact, if I didn't have a... Uh, well, if I did videos about other stuff, not just scams. You know, I may have dealt into crew crime and... Not true crime, not crew crime. Silly me. Yes, and done videos about people like John Wayne Gacy, Ted Bundy, Joseph Fritzl. You know, there's so many interesting stories. Hello, Ernst M. van der Linden. Apologies if I've messed up that name. Uh, let's have a look. Crew Trime. <laughs> Crew Trime, yes. Okay. Double check the social medias. And what I'll do is, seeing as I can't find a, a number quickly, I'll dial from Bobbit. Give me a moment. John Wayne lived next door to your uncle. Nice. I take it you mean John Wayne and not John Wayne Gacy. Pronounced correctly, that's good. I'll try SSA. Should be dialing now. Hello. Someone was asking if I. Hello. Yes. Yes, can you Yes, can you help me out? Okay, tell me. Drip 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 I got a message a voicemail from the Social Security Administration. WWW. Okay. So, what do you want me to do? Well, it said I had to call you up. Okay. 
Oh, okay, so, so is that it? I'm gonna get arrested here. We we need to get something sorted out. Ah, uh, who told you that you're gonna arrest it? The voicemail. Oh, that that was not my voice. Sorry. No, not your I voice. Didn't it it didn't sound voice. like you. It sounded like a. I don't know who oh. it sounded like, but it wasn't you. You sound different. Okay. Maybe you got the wrong number. No, it, it said add a quarter. Why not? No, and you're disturbing me while I'm talking with my bees. Well, you're talking with your what? With my bees. Can you please stop calling me? This is the first time I've called you. No, I had so many calls from your number. From my number? Well, it's not for me. Yeah. Okay, my team. It's the wrong number, so... Every single one need to go okay, behind the Okay, so what is going on here? Am I going to get arrested? I don't know, you have called me. No, I haven't called you. I don't you. know anything. I haven't called you at all. All I want to know is, am I going to get arrested? Hello? Okay, whatever. I don't know anything. You don't know if I'm going to get arrested or not? When did I say that I will arrest you? It's, it said so on a voicemail. But it's not my voice. What shall I do? <laughs> yeah, I've hung up. Hello, Luke Dog. Very sleepy, sleepy person. I mean, if they are in the US. What are they doing being asleep at this time? It's only what? What time is it over, over in America? Mid-afternoon? Mid-afternoon. I mean, I must have had a very busy morning to be that sleepy mid-afternoon. Yep, good to see uh, Luke Dog here. Somebody was asking if I if I pay for this filter thing. Um, I I do, I do. I've had to pay for a special license because I'm using it on on YouTube and I'm actually a monetized channel, so. I've had to pay for the pro version with the license and all that. William Fraser. Thanks for becoming a member there. That's very kind of you. That means you get your name in green up there and uh, get early access and uh, custom emojis. Name in the, uh, in the credits. All kinds of stuff. 1.30pm in California. Yes, yeah, so... Uh, that's practically lunchtime, isn't it? One thirty. Okay. Right. Uh, I also want to thank Malta and Stone Skull and Eric and Pixie Dust for the uh, super chat. So I'll give you a proper shout out at the end of the stream. Lovely. Okay. Let's move on. Let's move on. No twenty thirty here in Liverpool. At twenty thirty here in uh, Dan Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm, I'm on British time here. We'll do graphic. I do have to, um, yeah, I, I do have to make some more, uh, phony IDs and whatnot, pictures of phony IDs. Better than the Southern English. <laughs> Damn safe. Hello, Adrian. Uh, yeah, I might as well mention I'm working on quite a long, quite a long upload. But that'll be for the weekend. I think that's probably going to be around an hour long. And of course, there's a premiere coming up on uh, on Wednesday. The members should already have access to that. So make sure you keep an eye on the, uh, on the Shout out to moderators, Glowing Star. Thanks for that, Katerina. Yeah, shout out to all the moderators for moderating the um, moderated chat. We are going to tell Tech about Get in horror game. Oh, what horror game? You'll have to hear an American accent. Thank you for calling. If you know the extension of the party you are trying to reach, please enter it now. Party Otherwise, line. please remain on the line while your call is transferred. For calling support, how may I help you? 
Yes, I... Can you help me out on the computer? What computer, sir? My computer. Sorry? Can you help me out or not? Yes, I can. I can help you on your computer. Tell me, what is the problem? Well, I got the message. What message you got? Well, the message to call you up. What does it say? What do you mean, what does it say? You should know. You said the blasted thing. No, why should I? I don't spread any messages. You don't spread messages? No. Well, then how did I get your number? From where you get my number? Well, that's what I want to know. If I didn't get it from a message, no, where I the hell did I'm I get it from? You, you tell... How will I know from where you're getting my number on which message? Well, you said you didn't send a message. And I say you did, because that's where no. I got your number. This is uh, like department to book dominoes. You want to book some dominoes pizzas? Oh, very good. Okay, yes. Give me a... Give me a dominoes, eh? You got which a pepperoni? Pepperoni. Yes. Sm small, medium, large. Like it large. You need large. Yeah. Okay. And Give I'm me your address boy. and your card numbers. Okay, yeah, my card number is uh four eight two six. Mm-hmm. Four three eight. Mm -hmm. So that's a fan rate nerf. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. You want C V V on the back? Mm -hmm. No, I don't need that. You don't need a CVV on the back? How you can confirm the payment? No, nowadays, because because nowadays without CVV, we can charge the money. That's why. <laughs> oh, all right. So, yes, yeah. go, go ahead all and right, charge. All right, motherfucker. You get your pizza in 30 minutes. Bye-bye. Okay, you delivering it. Because you didn't get my address, you little harlot. They hung up. Showed us so. Chew the sauce. Chew the sauce. I do not know why I am starting to speak like this. But I will phone up for the social security people. What a load of a crap. Do they have a dominoes in uh, India? Oh, I am I am not knowing that. <laughs> I don't think we can afford this number. Something weird with the dialing. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. Pretend I'm from Dallas Cowboy. What, the, uh, the football team? And I mean football as in American football, not in proper football. Do a German accent and see if they don't want to scam German. I think they do want to scam Germans. I mean, if you haven't checked out one of uh, Brit Monkey's latest videos, they do actually try to scam the Deutsch, the Germans. Siski does Dallas. Very good. More like Brown Devi. Brown Devi. Yeah. Oh, you're disapp disappointed. Think you're getting pizza? Yes, Neep, of course. Neep, he's very good. Very good, there. Yeah. I think he, is he German? I think he's German. Pretend I'm Yosemite Sam. Oh, very good. Ah, you miss Adam. I was uh, speaking with Adam the other day. We were playing a bit of GTA and I'm getting a phone call. G'day. G'day. Can anybody hear me? No, I don't hang up. Hello, Helly Belly, 2727. Okay, let's dial it back. I mean, they obviously phoned me up for a reason. I guess the reason is the chocolate chew. Always a reason for the chocolate chew. Yeah, this guy ain't picking up. Hang up on him. Gonna have to refresh because it's stuck in that loop again. Fair enough. David was an honorary Welshman. Yeah, Terry, I, I miss the days of playing GTA and live streaming it. But hey-oh, hey-oh. I mean, it, it was a bit off uh, 
well totally unplanned we just happened to both be on the same thing at the same time so yeah that that was all good ah uh, yes obvious a teeth obvious a teeth let's try another number we've got ssa like horrible scam okay give that one a go oh apologize for yawning there an honorary tasmanian crikey <clears throat> Bit of a Kath and Kim name. Kath and Kim, that's going back a bit. Hey, Scott. No. Is it ring? I don't know. Uh, Skype. Okay, Mark, I'll, I'll try that. One moment, please. Larry Niven character. Larry Niven? Don't know what show that's from. Okay, okay, Mark Nye has provided us with a new SSA. Let me copy and paste it into the VoIP. Any Welsh speakers here? Oh, a science fiction writer. Nice, okay. Big up the phone. Hello. Is this a social... I hear you. Is this a social security people? No? Ah. Give it another try. Ah, oh, thanks for this. Did we get disconnect? No. E. E. Doc Smith was your favourite science fiction writer. All right. Okay, we'll try it one more time. Okay, see you, mistress. Thanks for calling Social Security Department. How can I help you today? Yes, I got uh, what was it? A voicemail from you. Regarding. Uh, regarding an allegation set upon my social number. Can you verify me your first and your last name so that I can go ahead and pull up your file? Yeah, Robert Lundman. Robert. Yeah. And your last name? Lundman. Do you want me to spell? Yes. L U N D M A N N. Lundman. M A N N. Yeah. And can you verify me your zip code, sir? Uh. My zip code, 43613. 43613, right? Yeah. Okay, and do you have any middle initial? No, no, no initial. Okay. Just stay on the line with me. Let me go ahead and pull up your file and see what exactly the reason regarding this call, okay? Okay. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much for being on the hold, your dear sir. I'm I'm still here, yes. Okay, so sir, is this the first time that you're receiving a call from our department regarding your social? Uh, yes, the first time. Okay. So here, sir, as I'm looking at your file, I can see that there are some allegations against your name. This means that your social security was used for illegal activities. So that's the reason you're receiving a call from our department because we have received an order to suspend your social security from law enforcement agency as we have found many fraudulent activities going on. So are you aware about the situation? No, this is the first time I've heard of it. Okay, yeah. so for me to go ahead and read out the full information to you regarding your social first, I want to make sure I'm giving out this information to the right person, not to any other. So can you please confirm me the last four digits of your social for your security purpose? Uh, 2046. And how old are you, sir? 52. Okay, I'm going to forward that last 40 of your 
also to my senior investigation officer who is authorized on your case. So sir here, can you grab a piece of paper and pen? I will provide you the case ID number and my information still so that you can know who you're speaking with. Okay, hold on. Yes. Okay, I've got paper and pen. Yes, first note it all. The case ID number start with the trampoline goes boing 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 among other things. W W W like Charlie. C seven zero three five one. Seven zero three five one. Yes. Okay. Yeah, and my name is Katie Wilson. K D Wilson. K D And my beige ID Every is single one need to go like behind the bar. And like Nancy, one oh two eight. S like S like Sam, Sam. Yeah. and like Nancy. Nancy. One oh two. Shall one oh three moderators glowing star. One oh two eight. One oh three eight. Two eight, okay. Number two, two eight. number eight. Yes. Yeah, can you read uh can you repeat uh read me back the number which I provide you? I want to make sure you got the right information. Yes, uh D C seven oh three five one. Uh your name's Katie Wilson and your S N one zero two eight. That is my badge ID, my employed ID, okay? Okay. Okay, thank you. I'm going to read a full report to you regarding your social. So, while I'm reading the report to you, please don't interrupt me. You'll be given a pure chance to speak for yourself once I'm done, okay? Okay. All right. So, here, this investigation started when we found an abandoned car on the south border of Texas, and the model of the car was Toyota Corolla, and it contained some blood and drugs inside. After what? the investigation... I'm sorry, sir? You said there's blood and drugs? Yes, sir. How the hell did that happen? Sir, let me read the full complete. Okay? Oh, Completely. Right. Yes. Let me complete. After that, if you have any question, you can ask me, okay? Okay. So while I'm reading the report to you, don't interrupt me. Okay. All right, sister, as I told you, we found a car in El Paso, Texas, and it contained some blood and drugs inside the car. After the investigation, we found out that the car was rented under your name and your personal information, there were two addresses linked with the titles of vehicles. The first address was 1254 16th Avenue, El Paso, Texas, and the second address is 5400 Sun Valley Drive, El Paso, Texas. So do you know anything about the address or are you familiar with that address? No, i I, I never been to El Paso, no. I've only been to no. Fort Worth and... Uh... Houston. Okay, I'm going to take the step. Uh, and Bona Chica, Boca, Boca Chica. Okay. Yeah, you, so you ever been the there? Address, yes, sir. The first address, which I mentioned to you, that was a fake address. And the second address of El Paso was read by the U.S. Marshal Officer, but unfortunately, there was no one inside the residence. However, the officer did have recovered 22 pounds of cocaine, which is an abusive drug, and some few paperwork and documents. Now, those paperwork and documents were linked with some few bank accounts, such as Chase Bank, Bank of America, U.S. Bank, Wells Fargo, and several more bank accounts. And all these paperwork have your name on them, and thousands of illegal money has been ranked from this bank account locally and internationally. What seems suspicious was, and all these transactions were made to the narco trafficking country like Mexico and Colombia. So, we as a Social Security Administration has filed a case against you for drug trafficking and money laundering. So during the same raid, the officer they have recovered more than seven credit cards, five debit cards, and ten to fifteen bank accounts, which has been opened under your name. So, sir, 
Do you have any explanation in your defense for this criminal activities under your social? No, I, I don't know anything about this. Uh, cocaine, you say? Yes. Well, no, all, I, I, I just deal in a little bit of black tar. That, that's all I deal in. Uh, don't, don't touch that cocaine. I'm sorry? I don't do the cocaine. That's, that's not me, no. Okay, so you tell them that you have nothing to do with those bank accounts, the cocaine, and the address which one week uh, in the El Paso, Texas. Well, I never, never ever go to El Paso, no. So can you please bank. tell me, did you ever lose your information, like your social, set ID, driving license, your wallet, in the past? In the past? In the past. Oh, in the past. No. Uh, I mean, you know, it's easy to get hold of people's information well, nowadays. But did you ever lose your information, or did you Deep ever Deep. share your Deep. information to money. anyone, friends, family members, neighbors, your co-workers, anyone who can use your information? I can't think of anybody who's who's taken my information. No. Sir, uh, let me tell you, at this very moment, <clears throat> it hurts for us to organize who is using your information in order to do all these criminal activities. It could be anyone, your friends, family members, your neighbors, your co-workers. So keep this information safe with you, okay? Until well, we know who's using your information. It, it, can't, be my, it can't be my co-workers. I, I'm, I'm self-employed. Okay. Yeah. So here, uh, let me tell you, at, uh, since the investigation has just begun, we are in process of finding the culprit, either it's you or someone else has told your details to do it. At this very moment, it's hard for us to recognize whether the assets belongs to you or the culprit. So we are going to fill up a form for assets verification under your name. So we can safeguard your true belonging and trace the remaining account and access which has been Okay, live by yourself, right? Yeah. Okay. And sir, I do believe that you have a car under your name, a vehicle. Uh yes, I, I got a car. Okay. How many vehicles under your name, sir? Oh uh, just one. Just one. I do believe that you have a valid driving license. A valid drive? Yes, I got, I got a, a driving license. Okay. And now, sir, we have to differentiate your bank account and the bank account which the imposter has owned using your information. So can you please mention the name of the bank which you are dealing with? Uh, yes, it's uh, Welsh Fargo. It's a Wells Fargo, and is this the only bank you're dealing with? The only. Oh, you got one more than one bank. Okay, this is the only bank you're dealing with, right? Yes, I. Uh, yes, it's. Okay, is that your checking saving, or you got just a checking and saving? Uh, both checking and savings. Both, right? Yes. So how many debit card you own under your name and how many credit card? Um, how many? I, I'm not sure, it's got the thing. I'm sorry, sir. It's just got the thing. So what I'm saying is that how many credit card you have under your name? Uh, I, I don't really have credit cards, I just have, um, I just have the thing. Just a debit card, right? Uh, yeah, ju just just debits, yes. That's all. Okay, you don't have credit, right? No, I, I don't have any. I don't really trust them. Okay. So now, sir, do you have any benefit from the government like SSI, food stamp, SSCI, unemployment, any benefit that you're receiving? Any benefit that I'm receiving? I... I have no yes. idea what's going on. Like SSI, food stamp, SSDI. No, I, I, I don't have. I, I pay for my own food. Okay. Yeah. So do you have any 401k plan under your name or IRA? Any investment under your name? 
an, an investment. No, yes. I, I just got Bitcoin and uh, a Dogecoin. That's all I got. Okay, you don't have any 401k and IRA, right? No, I, I'm not wonky at all. Okay, so can you please tell me on this recorded line the approximate balance you have in your checking account in your Wells Fargo? In my wall? I don't know what you in mean your in my Wells wall. Fergo. I say in your Wells Fargo bank account. Oh, in my bank account? Yes, sir. Oh, I... Last time I checked it was about 17,000. In your checking? In my checking? Yeah, I, yes. I'm not... In my checking and... Oh, God. I don't know. Can you help me out? I'm sorry, sir. Look, all I want to make sure is, am I going to get arrested or not? To see if you cooperate with us, okay? If you cooperate with us, we're going to help you out to clear your name from this case as soon as possible from our side, okay? Oh, all right, yes. So, the reason I'm asking on the balance you have in your account because we have to make sure that bank account is truly belongs to you, not to impose it. That's the reason I'm asking you the approximate balance you have in your checking account and saving account. So can you please tell me uh, what is the approximate balance you have in your checking account, sir? Uh, yes. I thought I said it's 17,000. And in your saving? In my savings? Yes, sir. At about 12, I guess. 1,200 or 12,000? 12, uh, 12 lakh. I'm sorry? 12 lakh. Okay, and what do you do for li your living, sir? Well, I do each and everything. I'm sorry? Each and everything, you know. All right, sir, uh, just give me a moment, okay? Stay on the line with me. I'll go ahead and forward all this information to my senior investigation officer, okay? Okay, Then I yeah. disconnect the line. Yeah. Thank you so much for being on the hold, you dear sir. Yes, I'm here. Yes, sir, can you please grab a piece of paper and pen? I will provide you a telephone number. Okay. What is it? Yes. I'm going to provide you a telephone number. So what you have to do is now, you have to click a valid picture of your ID, like your driving license or your set ID, okay? And you have to stand on that number, which I'm going to provide you, okay? Okay. All right. It's 202. 202. 735. 735. Three eight. Three eight. Zero four. Can you read it back to me, sir? What? I can't. Wait. I can't get A anything done. Can you read me back that telephone number which I provide you? No, I. I I'm not work. It's not working. What's going on? I'm sorry, sir. What's what going on? Hello? Hello? Yes, sir. Yes, what is... That's what I'm asking you. What's going on? What do you mean? What do you mean, what do I mean? I'm asking you if it's working. It doesn't seem to be working. Nothing seems to be working. What? What? What do you mean, what, what? What is not... I'm sorry, sir. What is not working? What do you mean, what is not working? I don't know what's going on here. Sir, can you please read me back the telephone number which I provide you now? No, I can't. I just told you that. Why is that? Because it's not working. Nothing's working. What? What's not working, sir? I just told you I don't know. <clears throat> Sir? 
Are you wasting my time? No, I'm not wasting your time. It's just nothing's working here. What do you mean by what is not working, I've sir? just told you I don't know why it's not working. You motherfucker. No need for that, little harlot. Okay, is it working now? There you go. Right. I uh, still don't know what's going on with all those alerts keep on popping up all the time, but, um... <clears throat> yes, I believe you missed a bit of that call out that before we just got disconnected, so, um... It's okay, I, uh, I recorded... Recorded it on the backup, hopefully caught most of the call there. Probably make it into a separate upload. Okay. Oh, I think I'm starting to lose my voice a bit. Hello, Amy McCartney. Quite a few people. Oh, there's like 23 still here. Thank goodness. Thank goodness we're still working. Okay. So where were we? Did we ever end the call? I don't know. Let's call it back. <clears throat> this one, because I ain't picking up. So, I'm going to go to Bobbit and dial from there. I'm sure we'll get a number or two. Okie dokie. Let's have a look. Amazon. Let's dial up Amazon. Uh, it's just uh, scrolling through at the moment. Desi. Looking for ad suitability. The party you are trying to reach is unavailable at this time. Please Hello, leave Kevin. your name, number, and brief message, and your call will be returned as soon as possible. Yes, this is the right number. Because I, I wasn't sure how I dialed you. Left him a message. Try a different one. Yes, what, I'll, what I think I'll probably do is... Um, I'll take down the live stream from today. And this second one, I'll mould them all together and edit them and uh, bleep out certain words. And then I will do a re-upload of like just a cause or something. Because I'm sure that that's what you guys will want to hear. Yeah, so I'll, I'll re-upload that as soon as, uh, soon as I can get it done. Hello, Sonic. Phone up for tech support now. Hello, unfreezable YouTube. Styling. Yes, Desi, I'll, I'll do that. You see, it's those alerts. Again, they just keep popping up all over the shop. And that one's hung up on me. Okay. Afternoon, D3. Hope you're doing all right. Hope everybody's doing all right. Okie dokie. Let's have a look. Amazon. Amazon number. Am I using a desktop? Yep, I'm using a desktop. Why isn't this dialing? No, they haven't taken it down yet. But I'm I'm going to take it down later. The and, phone number is not reachable at this time. And edit it and mold it with this one, Desi Dalu. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the membership there. Look at your name in green and uh, custom emojis, name in the credits. Early access to stuff. Got a miscellaneous number. Let's just try it out with a miscellaneous. Well, apparently this is Publicus Clearing S. Nice. If you're live streaming in ATL and someone says it, they boot. Don't know what you mean by ATL, but, um, wait, is my virtual camera not on? There we go. Sandy's doing all right. I think she's asleep at the moment. Thank you for calling the Publishers Clearinghouse. All of her assistants are busy at the moment, so leave a voice message with your name, your email, and your address, and someone will return your call and also your number. Thank you. Uh, this is Marcus Garvey calling on uh, 419 871 you, You'll get back to me with me with what? Terrible accent there. 
Someone was just saying Atlanta, Georgia for some reason. Hello, Ben King. Welcome back, everybody. So we may be getting a call from the public as clearly that. Is this live? No, JPS Holland, it's on Memorex. It's working. Yes, Iranian, it is working. We got an antivirus number. Can I use a voice changer? Well, I've got a voice changer, but I'm never any good at using it. I've got the old Roland VT4. Oh, well. Oh, well. Thank you for calling Northern. You are speaking with Paul. How can I help you today? Hello, Paul. Yes. Can you help me out or what? Yes, sir. Tell me how can I help you? Yes, I got, uh, what was it? Your message? What message, sir? About the virus protection on computer. Yes, sir. So tell me how can I help you about that? Well, what what do you mean? How can you help me? You got you gave me the message. Someone gave me the message. This is this is the technical team. Is you you are calling with the Northern technical team? Yes, yes. I was calling up Edward Norton. What did you say? Edward Norton for the computer. And may I ask your name? What's your name, sir? Yes, yeah, Robert Lundman. Just wait for a moment, sir. Okay. Okay, so do you have any technical problem or you don't have any technical problem with your computer? No, I got your message. That's why I called up. What message you received, sir? They said that I had called up for my antivirus, the protection systems of the network. Which, anti which antivirus do you have? Well, me, I, I got Norton. Norton 360. Okay. Yeah. Uh, not an issue, sir. I'm going, to, uh, I'm going to arrange the callbacks for you right now, right away. And you will receive a call back with a technician. Uh, is this the best number? 64163. No, call me back on 419 871 3148. 419 871 3148. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and your name is Robert, right? Robert Lundman, yeah. Okay, Mr. Robert, I'm going to arrange a call back for you right now, right? Bye bye. Okay, call, call it back. Okay, hopefully they'll, uh, they'll call it back on my number, on my text now. That'll be good, won't it? Yeah, I think I am starting to lose my voice a bit. It's a shame, it's a shame. Hello, Alma Ducky. Yeah, good to see some more people uh, joining the new stream. We have, what's that, 97 now or 57? I can't see about my glasses. Oh, well. Oh, well. So if they don't call us within the next couple of minutes, we'll be uh, off dial someone else. But I might as well take this moment to shout out those of you who've popped along to this second stream. Hold on, I've still got top chat open. Let's see who's here. We've got uh, 419 Brian, Amy McCartney, Ben King, Black Ocean 75, Bruno Mars, Desi Darrow, Dr. Fell, Electric Warrior, Ian Clark, Iranian Pride, Jamie, JPS Holland, Katerina, Malta, Martin, Milan, Sonic Stefan, Space Pirate, Star Chaser, the original Lurkalot, yeah, I like that name, Tommy Landry, and Unfreezable YT, or YouTube, I should say. Ah, oh, 57. Yeah, yeah, we are, we are live again. 57, just like Heinz Ketchup. I don't think they're going to be calling us. No, I don't think they'll be calling us at all. Hello, John B. Where are we? Where are we indeed? I go back into my social media and grab the other number. Okay, so we've got the uh, Kolkata. Kolkata SSA scan. Ah, yes, don't forget to retwiddle your thumbs down below and hit any, uh, any buttons down there or bells or whatever. It's all good. It's all engagement. And that's what the YouTube's algorithm's like. Are you doing all right, Dr. Phil? You know, it, it was a play on that. Uh... Hello? Hello, how can I help you? Yes. Can you help me out? What's the problem, sir? I got a voicemail. Alright, when did you receive that mail? Oh, what, about 20 minutes ago? The maybe half hour? Back. 
Smiley face. All right, sir. May I know with whom I'm speaking right now? Yes. It's Terry McDonald. All right. Terry McDonald. Yes. All right, sir. All right, just stay on the line, okay? Okay, yeah. <clears throat> and they hung up. Someone is asking if I had merchandise. Yes, I do. I have a merchandise at Teespring. For those of you who are interested, I want to thank Malta for the five Canadian dollars and Catherine there, there with the 50. Very kind of you. Um, let's see. Hello, Buddhist. Yep, I'm, I'm, I'm back online. We had some technical issues, but I'm back online. What it actually was was the OBS, uh, OBS Studio had a hissy fit and had to shut it down and reload it. And, uh, Shout out to all kind people who were patient. Ah, yes. Blue heart. Desi Dado there sporting the um, Desi Dado t-shirt. Very good. Let's try the next one. Let's try the next one. Give me a moment. Just checking the social media. <clears throat> Almost there. Ah, that's the number I've just dialed. Hold on. I have to find something else now. Blaster again with another... Yeah, we could dial it again. We could do that. Let's, let's dial it up. <phone rings> Dr. Fell has the Expo Musique shirt. And the, and the cigarette one. Nice. Now, I've come up with uh, another idea for a little logo, but I don't know... Um, It's something I, I would work on, but it's it's not a high priority at the moment. I believe the Teespring link is down in the description. Teespring.com slash stores slash Skeleton Siski store, I think it is. Richard Hunter. Dick. Do, 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 do. Dick. Sven Lakh Rupees. Nice. Okay. I'll try a number from Bobbit now. And also, almost forgotten, If I think if you're supervisor or above, you get a uh, a Teespring discount. I think that discount is in the uh, it's in the community tab for the uh, for you guys. Hello, is this a technician? Can you hear me? No, they've hung up. Call it back. The text now subscriber you are trying to reach is not available. Please leave your message after the tone. Yes, this is a uh, Rundi to Terima. Hey, I'm looking for a Rundi chewed Rundi to Terima. Hey, left him a message. Ah, you've just noticed enough of members tier. Yeah, there are three, three tiers, aren't there? There's um, there's normal members, then you've got the supervisors, and then you've got the top dogs. Well, it's, it's all good. Somebody wants a Samsung Galaxy S20 case. I don't know if Teespring do that, but if, if they do, um, I'm sure I'll I'll get something sorted out on there, Ben. If anybody's interested. I know they do the iPhone case, because everywhere does iPhone cases. And, you know, tried to disguise your $1,500 iPhone as a, as a cheaper thing. We're too poor to be top dog. Yeah, well, that's that's all right. I mean, all of the member stuff that that's just optional extras. As long as people come along, watch, leave a like, and subscribe, I'm 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 happy as uh, I'm happy as anything. I was going to say something else, but I think the phrase I was going to say is now politically incorrect, so I can't say that thing. Android all the way, yes. Falling through the snow, laughing all the way, do 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 do, Android all the way, 
Run de chood, run de chood, Terry Ma, hey. What do you mean, what's for dinner? Do you know what time it is? The Shiva is back. Smiley it's face. Half nine. It's half nine. It's half nine here. Way past dinner time. Shout out to all kind people who were already tried this number bar. Give it another try. Uh, oh, how's the weather across the pond? It, it's been very warm and sunny today. I think about. Must have been about 70. In between 70 and 75 degrees today. It's pretty damn warm. Honey bun. Yeah, winter is more or less over now. I mean, I guess that's why Americans on daylight savings and I'm still here on uh, Greenwich memes time. You don't get the whole Fahrenheit, it confuses you. Well, um, I, I think in metric money, it's about 20, 20 degrees. You still got to fill out that silly census form, Ben King? Yes, I've, uh, I've filled that out. That's a bit of a... A bit fucking stupid. You know, I mean, they say stuff until it's all automated, because if you put in your date of birth as bloody 1944, so obviously you're 70 odd years old, they want to know what, how many GCSEs you got and whatnot. And I'm thinking, if somebody's 74 years old, they would have gone to school way before GCSEs, O levels, and A levels. I mean, what, what the hell are they on about? I mean, I think GCSEs came in. Early 90s, something like that. I don't know. When did O level stop? I don't know. Cricket season soon? Maybe, maybe. I, I just keep an eye across the road from me because there's a, a cricket pitch there. You don't get metric, always have to use a converter. Basically, metric is anything that uses some kind of base 10 system. Everything seems to be base 10. Right, so I'm gonna try another 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 number from Bob. I'm guessing O level stopped in yeah, I think they stopped in the eighties or something. Okay, let's just dial up for a gift card and see what we can do. Yeah, Ian Clark, I, I've noticed that as well because I had to fill it out for um for an elderly relative. Hello, and Hello. thank you for calling. Just for calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of one hundred dollars. Press 1 now for more information, or you can hang up. Thank you. Thank you for calling. This is Danny Jackson. How may I help you today? Hey, Danny, how you doing, my man? You got to give me $100? Ah, you got to give me $100? Do you want $100? Ah. You have to pay $2 for buy a debit card, credit card. How would you like to pay for that? Ah, me got me TNA here. Hello, TNA. Just saw you there. Tammy King's back as well. It's Danny. Danny, Danny Chord. Danny, Danny Chord. He is our Andy Chord. He is Danny Chord. Hello, and thank you for calling. Just for calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of $100. Press 1 now for more information, or you can up. Yes, how can I help you? All right, is that Danny there? Pardon me? Danny. I was speaking to Danny. No? Maybe not. Round at all. Oi. Hello, and thank you for calling. Just for calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of $100. Fucking hell. Press 1 now for more information. Or you can hang up. Thank you. Thank you for holding. My name is Tony, and I'll be helping you claim your reward today. Can I get your first and last name, please? Yeah, Tony. My name is uh, Julian. I'm Ellis. All right. Can you hear me? Now, so you said, uh, yes, I can hear you. You said last name. Hey. Julian. Julian. Well, Mary. 
Okay, so the first name is Julian. Si. Okay, thank you. Last name Ramirez, right? Si. All right, thank you, ma'am. So great. Uh, you have the ability to select between receiving a one hundred dollar dining certificate or a fifty dollar shopping reward. Which one would you prefer? Si, me me want the me 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 food. Dining. Okay, the hundred dollar dining. dining. Great choice. And what address would you like me to mail your dining certificate to? Mm, I could just send it to a P.O. box. Uh, yes, I can send it to a P.O. box. Can I get that, please? Yeah, the, the P.O. box is uh, P.O. box 8234, Boca Chica, Texas. Okay, and the uh, zip code? No, no, it's a Boca Chica. Yes, ma'am, you said uh, P.O. Box 8264, but mm -hmm. I need the zip code. No, you, you don't need you don't need zip code, or you need this uh, Boca Chica. You ever been Where, to is Boca that Chica? in the United States? Mm hmm. I'm you sorry? Know, Boca Chica. No, ma'am, I, I need a zip code so I can send it to the P.O. Box address. What's the P.O. What's the zip code uh, that corresponds mm. to that P.O. Box address. In Texas. Okay, what city, ma'am? Boca Chica. Okay, so do you know the zip code of Boca? You said Boca Chica? Boca Chica. Boca Rica. No, Boca Chica. You with me your spell? Yes. Mm-hmm. B-O-C-A. C-H-I-C-A. Uh -huh. Boca Chica. Oh, Boca Chica Beach, right? No, Boca Chica, the Cameron All right, give me County a... near Brownsville. All right, give me one moment here. And let I've me see what the zip code is. All right, yeah, I'm looking for the zip code. Boca Chica. Yes, give me one moment, okay? I'm looking for that zip code. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm showing zip code is 78521. A Boca Chica. For Boca Chica, is that right? Mm-hmm. Okay, Brownsville. so the address... Give me one moment here. All right, yeah, uh, P.O. Box 8264 does not come up under that zip code. Uh, can you provide me with a valid address where I can mail this to, please? A Boca Chica. Yeah, that's not a valid address. Do you have an address or no? It's, it's near Brownsville. Uh, I need an address. When you provide an address, you got to provide the house number, building number, name of the street, and the zip code. Do you have a no. zip code available for me? Yes no. or no? All right, then you have a good day. It, it, Can I help you box. unless you give me a zip code? It's a P.O. box. A Boca Chica. And I think he's hung up there. I have no idea where I was going with that accent. It was all over the place. So totally. Thing. Oh, Star Chaser, P.O. box SN10. Very good. Although I think they've been uh, doing some stuff on SN11, haven't they? Saw that live stream yesterday where they were um, recycling, I guess they called it. <clears throat> Scammer voice changer or poo up notes. <laughs> That's quite a choice there, David Mungo. Boca Chica. At least I pissed him off exactly. At least I did. Very good. Very good. Let's move on. I think we'll keep the stream going f until like the top of the hour. Then what I'll do is I'll take both streams down, edit them together and we'll try and do something or other. And then I'll do an, a re-upload. Oh, you want me to call him back? I've just lost the number because it was in Bob. Let me see if I backspace, maybe that'll do it. Yeah. 89 viewers and 44 likes. So you got a like, boy. <laughs> Feeding in a state. Hello, a... and thank you for calling. Just for calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of $100. Press 1 now for more information, or you can hang up. Thank you. Wait, Pierce. Thank you so much for holding. My name is Brandon. I will be helping you claim your rewards today. Provide me with your first and last name, please. Right there, Brenda. Yeah, uh, my name is Kevin Wilson. Your phone up for under dollars. 
Are you in the United States, sir? Oi. Where are you then, sweetheart? I don't think he believes I'm in the United States. I think I'm a bristle. I'll call it back. You made it 50? Nice. My upload in West Country for uh, fucking areas. Hello, and thank you for calling. Hello, Just TC. For calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of $100. Press 1 now for more information. Or no you idea, hang up. electric. Thank you. Just for calling today, you're entitled to a retail rebate of $100. So much for holding. My name is Carles. I will be helping you to claim a reward today. Can I have your first and last name, please? Right there, Tyler. My name is uh, Giles Higginworth. Uh, that's J O E? No, G I L E S. Giles. And then Higginworth is H I W G E N W O R T H. Thank you. Now you have the awesome ability of selecting between a monthly $100 shopping reward or a $50 dining certificate. Which one would you prefer? Well, we'll get some of that shopping done. You can use it to shop at up to 8,000 stores of your choice like Macy's, Target, Bloomingdale's, Express, Saks Avenue, and many other stores of your choice, okay? All right. Now, what is, now what is your address for us to mail this out to you today? Yeah, could you send it over to uh, 019 Cedar Stone Drive, Toledo, Ohio? Could we get for Landy as a guest? Code? 43 4364 No, six, 43613, that's what it is. Four three six one three. Oi. And you said it's four one nine Cedar Stone. Cedar Stone Drive. Uh, I'm out of that little farm. The little farm ass. Thank you. Now, just to verify the phone number I'm seeing here for you, which is nine zero nine two nine three five zero three eight. Correct. Yeah, but that ain't my normal number. You want my normal number? Let's go ahead with that number. No four one nine. 871-3148. Thank you. Now, bear in mind, the reward is going to be mailed out to you today, so this will get to you within 24 to 48 hours. So as soon as you receive it in the mail, you can go straight ahead and use it. It does not come with an expiration date. That's the good thing about it, so you can use it whenever it's convenient for you. You have up to 8,000 stores of your choice, so you can use it to buy whatever you want. You can also use it for car washes, dry cleaning, movie tickets, and many other things. And if you're a person who likes to shop online, you can also use it to shop online as well. Now, in order to mail this out to you today, the only thing we ask you to do is to handle a small one-time processing fee of only $4.95 to get this out in the mail to you today. You can use a Visa or a MasterCard for the $4.95. Which one will you be using? X. I'm sorry? X. Read me the numbers on the card that you're going to be using. Amex. Can you hear what me? What card will you be using for the Amex. 495? Amex. So read me the numbers on the card. 3, 6, read. 4 and 9. The card has to begin with a 4 or a 5. Read no. me the numbers on the card. I, I, I keep telling you it. Amex. Amex card. Yes, but the, but we are we are on a direct line here with Visa and Mastercard. So based on consumer protection laws, if anyone at all tries to bill your card without your consent, or even get unauthorized charges, you have the right to remove those charges. So the bottom line is, you are 100% protected by your debit and your credit card company, and we as a company won't risk being blacklisted for just $4.95 charge. So read me the numbers on the card that you're going to be using for the $4.95. It has to begin with a 4 or a 5. No, it begin free. It's Amex card. I can only I can only accept a card that begins at four or five. So provide me with the number on the card. What a bloody I ain't got no I ain't got no Visa or or Mastercard. I I'm a, I ain't got no Master. I'm a free man. That's why I got the uh, American Express. 
You don't go on without right. it. Don't leave on without it, rather. You know, like the All old right. commercials, they go, you know, don't leave on without it, and then they pay with the Amex and everything's so sorted, because they go all around the world and they accept it all over the place. I guess that's a wonderful day. Well, don't take your Amex. I won't be able to use a car that begins with a 3. I have to use a car that begins with a 4 or a 5. Why well, don't you we're have a number a 3 on your keyboard? Uh, we're on a direct line with Visa and MasterCard, so we are only allowed to use a Visa or a MasterCard. Well, that's not very good then, is it? Can I pay you a Bitcoin? I have yourself a wonderful day. Bye -bye. Can I pay you a Bitcoin? No, you can only use a Visa or a MasterCard. Bye bye. Have what about Dogecoin? You got any of that Dogecoin? No. Hello, Luke Dog. No, I wasn't done. We just had a lot of uh, technical difficulties here. Hey ho. Hey ho. <clears throat> Fair enough. Uh, v Bucks. Isn't that a. Is that Roblox or is it Fortnite? I always get those two mixed up. Hand off to the organ grinder. <laughs> Omna monkey, not the orphan. Or, I was about to say orphan grinder. That that's just wrong. That's just so very very wrong. Okay, we could try SSA now. Social Security Administrations. The phone number is not reachable at this time. FW, I am from England. I'm a British boy. That number is unavailable. One moment. Try Amazon. Amazon working. Hello, Su Susan Levers. Hello, Joanna. Ah, you're in Devon. Nice. <phone rings> No, they hung up. UK numbers w wouldn't be any good at this time of night. I mean, it's 10 to 10 here now. Don't know any scammers who are active at um 10 to 10. When they reach their limit, they hand off the, the whole course. Okay. Are you right back in a few minutes? Okay, Jamie? Yes, yeah, so we'll probably be live for another 10 minutes, then... Uh, then we'll, we'll sort something out with the two streams, mold them all together, censor out the naughty stuff and, uh, you know, the stuff that could get me done on, on YouTube. And we'll just keep going. We'll, we'll do a re-upload. As a matter of fact, I've got an idea. Now, there's a new feature on YouTube where you can go from, like, a stream to a premiere or a premiere to another live stream i'm gonna see if i'll be able to um seeing as i have a premiere ready for tomorrow anyway i'll i'll try and uh, do like one after the other so i'll try and get this re-upload done up up to uh here and i'll try and you know link one to the other so that you can just watch two uh, one after the other. I'll, I'll try and use that new feature on YouTube. Oh, it's uh, ten to nine where you are. Nice. Let's um, let's try another couple of numbers. Give me a moment. I'm just gonna double check the social media because I think there's a new number on there. Hello, hello, Shaka, Shaka Cat. Yeah. Um. Okay. Right. Do I have an SSA number I can try? I don't know if I've already dialed it, but I don't think I have. It's 555 for you are TNA. So I'm guessing that's uh, East Coast. Oh, good to see you here, FW. Always good to see new people. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, I have already dialed this, but we'll give it another go. Lovely. Hello, BH Andy. I don't think this guy's going to pick up. Going to have to refresh because it's still ringing. 
23 53 in Cyprus. Nice. Okay. By Christmas 2021. Yeah, I, I reckon there's a good chance I could hit 10k by Christmas. You know, if, if things keep going the way they do. May even reach a bit higher, but, you know, I'm looking forward to a uh, a reasonable milestone. Yeah, we're going to try one more number. Actually, I'll try it through Bobbit. Loading up the phone book. Tech support Microsoft. You need a sandy ringtone soundboard. Well, I don't know, Dr. Phil. I mean, it's a bit all over the place. Sometimes I only get like six a day and other times like today I've gotten like 50. So it's all, all a matter of averages and shit. Anybody there on the phone? Hello? Anybody on the phone? The phone number is not reachable at this time. Not reachable on the crime. Okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Where's my live stream thing? I've lost my live stream uh, window. So this? Oh, here it is. Okay, so we got, what, 80 people watching now? That's pretty damn good. So I might as well say, um, start to wrap things up now. I want to thank those of you who've done donations through Streamlabs today. I'm quickly going to open up the Streamlabs because that should have a list of all the super chats as well and seeing as we've had the issues today with the old um with the old super chats, well with the whole live stream basically um I'm going to use use Streamlabs to uh grab a list of who's done what today. So give me one moment. Just sign into the Streamlabs. Almost there. Then I can give a proper shout out to everyone. Oh yeah, let's get Dr. Fell to 1000. That'll be damn good. That'll be pretty damn good. Okay, so let me just scroll through. Okie dokie. So I want to thank, let's see. Lisa, who's donated $2 with Never Gonna Give You Up. Never Gonna Let You Down. Never Gonna run around and desert you uh william fraser who's become a new member that means your name's in green you get the name in the credits uh the access custom emojis stuff like that ernst air van der linden with five euro 49 thanks for that it's a beautiful day sun is shining uh the official lurk a lot with five great british pound sterling new pencing plead guilty here's some bail money uh, Desi Daru, who's become a new member, again, name in green, custom emojis, name in the credits, early access, all that good stuff. Malta with five Canadians, saying the sheep is back. Katerina with 50, I think it's Czech crowns, isn't it? Shout out to all the kind people who are patient. And uh, Luther Fleming with 419, and we get Paul Andy as a guest. That would be quite incredible if we could, quite incredible. Okay, if I've missed any from the last stream, I apologise, but it doesn't seem to show up anywhere. Anything else? Um, yeah, of course. This live stream's going to go down. The, the uh, other live stream's going to go down. I'm going to merge them all together, and uh, it's going to end up with like a double, a double premiere tomorrow, hopefully. Because I've got one premiere ready, ready and waiting. Of course, members already have access to that. But that's going to go to premier mode at midnight, which is going to be a couple of hours time. Uh, 10k face reveal. No, no, TNA. I'm, I'm not going to be doing the taste. Not taste for <laughs> face reveal. Nah, that ain't my bag. Okay. Um, yeah, I want to thank the moderators here for moderating. I want to thank everybody for popping along through both streams, helping out and twiddling the thumbs down below. Whatever things are down there, like the... Uh, like the buttons and the bells, make sure you hit all of them. Uh, 10k subs, 10 hour live stream. Or oh, I very much doubt I'll be able to do another 10 hour live stream. 
I did one at 1k and that was uh, that was pretty painful. But I want to thank everybody for popping along, all the members, all the mods. Time to just go ahead and do that outro thing. So, yep. Yeah. Ta-ta for now. Stay aware, stay safe and all that good stuff. Bye.